Hi, we're in Kuala Lumpur, Malaysia for DSA 2024 on the booth of the Royal Malaysian Navy with Typhoon Osberg, our Turkish-based correspondent. Typhoon, good morning. Good morning, Xavier. How are you? I'm uh, great, but uh, quite tired with the jet lag, obviously. So we are standing beside uh, what they call here in Malaysia locally the LMS Batch 2. Uh, it is a Turkish design based on the ADA class Corvette from the Milgen project. The contract is not signed yet, but uh, it should be by the end of the year. So this is a, like an ADA class Corvette, but uh, with a different configuration. Yes, uh, the dimensions of the ships are the same with the uh, version used by the Turkish Navy for 15 years. But uh, there are some slight differences uh, in terms of equipment. Uh, for example, uh, this uh, ship features air defense capabilities with four cells of surface air missiles. As far as we learned from the Malaysian officials, uh, the Royal Malaysian Navy selected uh, South Korean surface air missile. That's right, uh, so we learned that uh, it will probably be Haegung or Kaesam from LIG Next One from uh, South Korea. These missiles can be quite packed, so even though we see only four cells, it will actually be 4x4, four four, so 16 uh, surface-to-air missiles. Uh, on the topic of missiles, the anti-ship missiles uh, is likely to be at Maja from Turkey as well. Yes, we learned that uh Malaysia will select uh, rockets and made Atmaja surface-to-surface missiles for the LMS Batch 2. And so that missile is becoming a little bit popular in the region because there are rumors also about Indonesia procuring that, uh, that anti-ship missile. Uh, so when that deal is official, Malaysia will become the fourth uh, user of uh, that design. Yes, uh, Turkey is the first user of this uh, ship and uh, Pakistan will be second and Ukraine will be third and Malaysia will be fourth customer of uh, this ship. Uh, plus there is another difference uh, in terms of radar. Uh, the Turkish version uh, is fitted with Talis made uh, Smart SMK2 uh, air surveillance radar but this ship is as far as we understood from the mock-up that uh, will be fitted with a uh, Genk S uh, ISA radar made by Aselsan, just like in the TCG Istanbul, the first I class frigate. So, this is the Turkish uh, design. Uh, the Corvette for Ukraine is made in uh, Turkey. The Corvettes for Pakistan are made both in Turkey and Pakistan. Do we know if these ships would be built in Turkey or here in Malaysia? Uh, as far as I learned, the first ship will be built in Turkey and the remaining ships uh, are not certain yet, but probably will be built in Malaysia. But uh, STM didn't select the shipyard yet. All right, thank you very much, Typhoon. So that was the LMS Batch 2 model on the RMN booth at DSA 2024.